Dr. Sean, Professional Alternative Education. Exploring the link between psilocybin and the default mode network. Over the past few years, there has been a lot of buzz around psilocybin, a psychedelic compound found in some types of mushrooms. Let's take a closer look at how this works. It's responsible for helping us think about ourselves and our place in the world, which is why it's sometimes referred to as our internal dialogue. How does psilocybin affect the DMN? Recent research has found that psilocybin can significantly alter activity in the default mode network, offering potential therapeutic benefits for a variety of conditions. In a study conducted at Imperial College London, researchers administered psilocybin to participants before having them complete cognitive tests. They found that those who had taken psilocybin showed improved performance on tasks related to creativity, problem solving, and decision making. A subsequent study conducted by John Hopkins University School of Medicine uncovered similar results after they administered psilocybin to healthy volunteers. They found that those who took the psilocybin showed better performance across all three measures compared with their pre-ingestion baseline results. Another recent study from the University of Zurich examined how different doses of psilocybin affect brain connectivity in people with depression. The researchers discovered that higher doses correlated with reduced connections between regions in the DMN, a key network involved in depression. This suggests that taking different amounts of psilocybin could bring about varying effects on mood regulation and emotion processing. The potential long-term outcomes of augmenting the default mode network via use of psychedelics are numerous and varied. Perhaps most notably, research into this area suggests that regular and repeated use of psychedelics may result in improved cognitive functioning as well as higher levels of creativity. Moreover, recent studies have also suggested that long-term use of psychedelics may confer protective effects against certain mental health disorders such as depression and anxiety. Scientists have theorized that sustained use may potentially lead to more lasting structural changes within the brain, such as altered neuronal connections and increases in dendritic spine density. The research between psilocybin and the default mode network is providing strong evidence that psilocybin has a significant potential to be used as an effective treatment for mental health and neuroplasticity. With all these promising findings, it's likely that more research will continue on this topic with even more promising outcomes related to mental health neuroplasticity.